What up, family? It's Nine Million, and I'm back with another vlog. Another day getting to another dollar, man. Just finish with my little daily hustle real quick. Put in a few hours, I say. What time is it? I got out at like nine. It's now one. Well, I probably did about three hours or so all together with my Lyft and Uber hustle. Uber's killing Lyft still. Stay more busy with them than I do with Lyft. But Lyft is has its own it has its my own bonuses and shit, so that's what makes it worth it to do it with them. But needless to say, I'm back at the crib now. We're going to see a movie. But in between time, I called um, a couple of companies. I got a little information on debt consolidation. Um, these are the authorization letters that we sent to your creditors. They're going to give us authorization to communicate with on your behalf. Once you start the program, you will get creditor calls, but this is a natural part of the process. Creditors usually attempt to collect before they negotiate with us. Many times those calls are automated robo dials, so don't feel bad for ignoring them. The easiest thing to do is just disregard them. You should also update the phone number your creditors currently have on file to our dedicated creditor hotline number. And that's going to be in your welcome packet. Uh, I think that would be can be a decent move for me because I am in debt and I'm trying to minimize my payments, man, especially since I'm about to be going to school and I won't be able to earn. You know what I mean, I'm be in there like eight hours a day. You know, obviously, we got the baby at the house, so I'm going to have to put in mad hours at school and my baby. When I get off of work, I'm going to have to watch the baby so my old lady can go to work and do her thing. So I was thinking that consolidation would be a good plan. But after talking to them, I found out that I'm not eligible for the debt consolidation loan, which would allow me to be able to pay them off, pay off the credit, and uh, just make you know my, whatever my payments are on their loan. I don't qualify for that, but I do qualify for... Uh, I don't know what they called it. I forgot what they called it. But basically, all in all, what I will have to do is stop paying all my accounts that I want to get settled. A settlement a settlement account. Settlement payment. So I will have to not pay my accounts. And once the accounts get closed out, then um, the this consolidation company would then contact those creditors and negotiate a settlement. So basically all the money that I would be paying would be about half of what I'm paying now if I were to keep my payments up. I would pay into my settlement account, my personal account. I would pay my monthly payments into that. The consolidation company would then take those payments and pay the settlements through the creditors. Hopefully that makes sense. I pay the, the consolidation company and consolidation pays on the settlements that they negotiated with my closed credit account. I'm kind of on the fence with if I want to move forward with that or not because I am going to be taking a credit hit because I'm not going to be paying those payments. They say it's going to be about three to six months until they get a settlement amount from the creditors because the creditors want to take some time to reach out to me and try and get that account settled on their own uh i don't know if y'all got any uh advice or if y'all moved in that direction at all on your own please let me know get in the comments uh i'm kind of on the fence man i'm gonna think about it because i haven't missed any payments on my on these accounts None of my my um none of my credit cards. I ain't missed nothing, so it's gonna be hard not to pay them for three to six months waiting for me to get a settlement. They did say that the the accounts that I do have open, they do negotiate. So I shouldn't have I w I shouldn't worry about them not accepting the terms, you know what I mean? And me now I got closed accounts that I gotta pay on. They're guaranteeing they work with these people. So I don't know. In the comments, let me know. Go check on the baby and the lady. Get ready to go to this movie. I'll holler back in a little bit, y'all. Peace. Tell them where we going. What you about to do? Oh, you mad?
laptop. Are you in your feelings? <laughs> no laptop. Talk. Tell them. No. You gonna go to auntie house? No. You don't wanna go to auntie house? <laughs> you, you sleepy, huh? <laughs> yeah. No. You sleepy. No, we're Anyways. So, we about to get ready. We going to the movies. We gonna go see Wakanda forever. And we gonna get rid of this one. She gonna go. She gonna go hang out with her auntie.